Hello everyone, today I want to tell you how to connect the Pixie camera to EV3. For connecting we will need the wire. If you have same wire you can use it, but if you didn't have you can make it yourself. For making wire we will need the standard EV3 wire, 4 of this wire and soldering iron. Firstly, we need clean the main insulation of the EV3 wire and remove insulation of blue, yellow, green and red little wires. After, we need to solder these wires as shown in the video. As a result, we get such wire. Don't forget to isolate the soldering places. EV3 wire have an X pinout and Pixie original pinout looks like this. We will connect the wire with next game. Connecting the wire. After connecting to EV3, Pixie original must light so. After, we need to set up the camera. For this, to download the Pixie Moon, After, connect camera to laptop using mini USB. Clean all signatures. And set first signature like a red ball. Connecting Pixie original to EV3 using EV3G. At the first we need put LEGO I2C in settings of interface in Pixie Moon. Also we need to download the EV3G block for working with camera. After installing the block, write a simple program which will be print coordinates and size of the object.
test the program. Connecting Pixie Original to EV3 using Clever. At the beginning, put I2C in settings of interface of Pixie Moon. It's a simple program for getting and printing values from camera. A few words about this program. Its constants and arrays. Send array is empty because of Pixie Original work only in one mode and didn't uh, need input parameters. The next is endless cycle, which getting and printing values. For getting values from camera, we will need to use sensor communicate I2C command. After printing row values into columns and converting row values to normal values of coordinates and size of the object. Printing converted values to screen and delay for normal printing. Test the program. Connecting Pixie 2 to EV3, same with Pixie Original. Pin out of Pixie 2 like this and pinning same with Pixie Original. And for set upping, we will need to use Pixie Moon second version. For working with EV3G, we will need to put LEGO I2C in settings of Pixie Moon 2 and download EV3 block. Blocks for Pixie Original and Pixie 2 is different as a Pixie Moon. For connecting Pixie 2 to EV3 using Clever, we need put I2C in settings of Pixie Moon 2. This code same with code for Pixie Original, but Pixie 2 have uh, several modes. To say Pixie 2 which mode we want to use, here we give input parameters like array. About other modes and parameters, you can learn on official website of Pixie. All links will be in description. Thanks for watching.